the last problem looks really easy, doesn't it? I think so too. And it is. It's not hard at all. I do want to point out though that it's necessary to go through this one because this is going to happen very frequently and I want you to gain just a very fast understanding of how to do it. So I'm going to go through this one relatively slowly and then you'll be able to just identify it and say this is what you do and it, it's a fast, fast process. Okay, so 5 minus x. What do you look for first? A GCF. Actually, let's back up a little bit. I'm going to I'm gonna start in a different place other than looking for a GCF. And I'm going to do something that I personally like to do, and I'm going to put it in order. Order of descending exponents, which means negative x plus 5. This looks like slope-intercept form in a sense, but basically we have our variable first and then our constant term second. Now we'll talk GCF. Is there a, a number that divides out of negative 1 and 5? Well, 1. But actually, another thing that I like to do, I like to factor out any negatives that are in the very front. It just makes it convenient. Trust me, it does. So we're going to factor out a negative 1, and then that means it changes both of those signs, so we have x minus 5. And so then, and this is what, is what was written here is correct, but you could just put negative and then x minus 5. So here is the point of this problem. I want you to be able to identify something that's written backwards with subtraction and just turn it around and factor out a negative one. Let me show you what I mean. If somebody just handed you um, 12 minus y and they said factor that, you'd be like it doesn't factor, it doesn't, but it does because using all those same steps, super fast, it'd be neat if I could click my fingers and it just showed up, but using that super fast, negative and then y minus 12. Totally fine, same thing. So again, whoa, there I go. I'm flinging the problems everywhere. <sighs> we'll get the hang of this thing here in a second. Um, if I had 35,000 minus um, AB, then I can AB minus 35,000, but I factored out a negative one to do it. That's what happened. 